uh, what do people usually talk about during these interview things? I mean, they're not interviews exactly. We're just supposed to talk as if the camera wasn't here. Cool. Exactly. I mean, I guess we could start with how epically late Fred is to this meeting. I mean, not even Fred, Fred late, late, but <laughs> <laughs> seriously late. Right. I think he has an excuse this time, though. I'm a, a real excuse. I heard he's meeting with Bullstrode. Oh, God. You don't like him either? <laughs> Bullstrode? <laughs> I would love to see how that meeting is going. I mean, I imagine it's sort of like... Professor Bulstrode, I, I didn't mean what I said when I said I had the Featherstone internship in the bag. <laughs> Are you sure you didn't mean what you said, Mr. Vincy? Because speaking as someone who has your best, best interests interest at heart, heart, I can tell you what you have just said is an entirely inconsistent falsehood. <laughs> That was one of the best Bullstrode impressions I have ever heard. Spot on. <laughs> hey, what's the matter? Nothing. I mean, it's just... Girl stuff? I don't know. I thought you weren't a girl. Yeah. I'm not binary. Okay. Good job. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I I mean more like dating girl stuff uh, or like not doing that. Well, let me tell you, I've been down that road before, and I would steer clear of it if I were you. After an experience that I had last year, I I won't go into any detail. It was messy. I mean, I personally will be staying away from anything resembling a committed relationship, and I recommend you do the same. I think this is more of a time to focus on my studies, you know what I mean? Yeah, I guess. And honestly, like, why should we be expected to just throw ourselves into a relationship just because we find someone attractive, right? Like, flirting is fun and nice, but who needs that kind of, like, heartache? I feel like college is more about building relationships that last. Like, I have more important things to do than get into some fling. You know what? So do I. Like, do you mind if I take off? Um, I don't think Fred is coming anyway. No, not at all. Go for it. Where are you going? I... I hope this will be a really great thing for you. I hope so too. <laughs> And I'm so sorry if I ever said anything about Sabin that was mean. I had no idea you felt that way. No, it's fine. I'm not really in a place to judge. We both know I don't say the nicest things about people I don't like. Come in. Jamie? Hey. You got my text, right? Yeah, I, I did. Uh, then... Actually, Dot, I heard about you and Kasabin. You did. But I just wanted to say that I'm... I hope you'll be really happy together. He obviously doesn't deserve you, <laughs> but you're doing what you want and that's important. Thank you, Jamie. I mean, that means a lot. Do you want to stay? We have tea and cookies. Yes, please stay. I have a bunch of ideas about the documentary that I wanted to talk to you about, and I mean, like, if you have time, of course. No, I will. I'll stay. How's your tea? It's good. Good. Thanks for having me over. Anytime. Hmm.